Water Buffalo TM. Motherfucker! What's up guys, it's Old School Matt here. Today I'm gonna to be doing my shoulder workout. I'm gonna be showing you guys how to hit an effective shoulder workout in under 35 minutes. We're gonna be starting off, all you really need is some dumbbells. I got three sets of dumbbells. I got two different types of plates. I got a bench, you don't need a bench if you don't have one. I have a barbell with some weight as well. So the more the better, but I'm gonna be trying to keep it minimal here. We're gonna start off with the three sets of dumbbells and we're gonna move into some other movements. So without further ado, I'm gonna set the timer up and uh, I'm gonna have you guys come along for the ride. So let's get it, set the timer right now. And before I start my workout, I gotta let you guys know this workout is powered by Buff Sauce, my pre-workout for Water Buffalo TM. I'm taking some watermelon today. So let's chug down the pre, shake it up a little bit more. Bottle of water would be nice and a rag would be nice as well. So I hope you guys enjoy this workout. Let's get right to it after I take my pre. So we're starting off the timer now. Let's get to it. Gonna be starting off with some 10 pound dumbbells. We're gonna do three sets of 10 with a five second rest period in between. Not dropping the dumbbells. What you wanna do here is you wanna activate the shoulders, making sure every rep counts here, guys. We're activating the shoulders, warm up time. Let's get it. All right, that's 10. Take a five second break. Like I said, this is just the warm up. We're getting those side delts ready to go for some murder. Right, that's another 10, another five second break. So ideally here, guys, we're gonna start with the side delts whenever we train shoulders. So that's what we're gonna start with after this warm up exercise. Let's get it. Alrighty. Okay, so let's start off with the, I'm using 20 pound dumbbells. It's up to you how much weight you wanna use. We're gonna start with some upright rows with the dumbbells. We're gonna be switching over to some side lateral raises with the arms at the side. Let's go for 10 each. We're gonna get 10 each, and then we're gonna be taking a 15 second break. You ready? Let's do it. Super important, keep the elbows wide on the upright rows. I'm already feeling it. So this movement super similar to a side lateral raise. You wanna make sure those elbows are wide and you wanna make sure you get a nice squeeze on the rear, on the uh, medial delt, on the side delt. Ready? We go 10 there and we go 10 here. down, take a 30 second rest. We're about two minutes into the workout. So the whole idea behind this superset is you wanna go heavy with the rear, uh, the side delt raises, uh, upright rows, and then you wanna go into the side raises. Ideally using a weight that's a little bit heavier for you for side raises, typically for side raises, I like to keep it light anyways. So I'm gonna use the 20s here for the, for the, uh, Upright rows and then going into the side lateral raises. Bear with me guys, I've never done a live workout before so getting used to it, I wanna do more of these so let's get right into it. Like I said, elbows wide, you wanna come up, squeeze those medial delts, the side delts. There goes my headphone. Then we get the 10, one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Woo. Now the rest, 30 seconds. Get these headphones back in so I can stay up to tune with you guys. Let's see. Take a walk over here. I don't got a cameraman operator. Let's see how the video's looking. Video's looking great, guys. I'm excited. Woo. 
Get another 30 seconds, got another 10 seconds on the block. It's gonna be the first exercise slash superset for this workout. Keeping it nice and easy, still easing in. I still consider this kind of like a warm up exercise, but we're really getting into the movements now, so let's do it. One last set. see my counting gets a little weird whenever I get to certain reps I like to count from the middle and it's just a way for me to keep my brain thinking so another 30 seconds and then let's move on to the second side lateral or a second side delt superset in between my sets a lot of times I like to usually uh, check my Instagram no I'm just kidding a lot of times I like to swing my arms around get loose and uh, feel good so we're almost at that 30 second mark guys so stay loose Pose, flex, whatever you gotta do. And then let's move on to the second superset. So, like I said, I'm gonna keep it 100% live here in the Water Buffalo Gym, putting away my buff sauce. The pump right now is starting to really come on. So, this second exercise is gonna be for the side delts again. We're gonna be doing what I like to call flappies. I don't know what the proper term for this exercise is. Side lateral pulses. And then we're going to switch into some Arnold presses seated without back rest. So let's do three sets here, guys. And we're going to be shooting for time instead of actual reps. So it's quite hard for me to see my timer over here, but I'm going to estimate. So let's do 30 seconds of flappies and then we'll move on to the Arnold presses for 10 reps. Ready? Let's go. And guys, this might get difficult, so what you wanna do when you have the feel, you have to rest, throw the arms up over the head. You don't wanna keep the arms down. No, down here, you wanna stay up. Ah, five seconds. One, two, three, four, five, woo! Man, that is killer, guys. And again, you guys do as I say, not as I do. If I take a rest and I gotta kinda chill out and you guys are ready to keep going, you all keep going. Let's go straight into these Arnold presses. I'm using 50s, again, whatever, whatever way you feel comfortable for you guys. So. seven minutes right now so as you guys see this is quite the challenge take a minute rest for this one Woo. feeling like my arm is about to fall off after this superset we got one more superset we're gonna do two more sets here and then after that we're gonna be doing one more superset for the side delts but I'm gonna give you guys your minute starting to get more intense as you see I didn't turn the fan on it's quite hot in here so alrighty let's get after it about five seconds left guys let's go let's go let's get going uh, okay 30 seconds Remember what I said, over the head if you gotta rest, over the head if you gotta rest. You got five seconds left. One, two, three, four, five. Woo-wee! 
my arms, my whole freaking biceps are on fire. That means that uh, my delts are definitely fatigued. Got other body parts moving in. So let's try to focus on the delts here, guys. Straight to the Arnold process. Let's get 10, ready? Ah. Last two reps are kind of rough there. Another minute break here, guys. Those last two reps were, were absolutely terrible. So what do you do in that scenario? You push through, you give it your best shot. Oh man. So the whole idea behind this superset is that we're hitting the side delts, we're tiring the side delt before we get into the presses. You know, typically I can press over 100 pounds, no problem for a shoulder press. But um, this one's definitely whooping me. So you pre-exhaust the side delts there, and then when you're pressing, you're more likely to uh, exhaust the side delts on the presses. So let's go, I think I got another 15 seconds left, and then we're back on it. Fucking burns, guys. It's a great workout. Fantastic. I'm loving. I'm loving this actually. You know what? Cause I get a workout. You guys get a workout. I can go do other shit. I can get my workout nice and efficient and get it done. So we're about one third of the way through the workout, which means we got to get going because we still got front delts, side, uh, and rear delts to go. So let's move right into the last superset here, guys. Well, the last set of the superset. The next set is the last superset for the side delts. I don't got a camera woman operating today, so I gotta just say within the space. All right, so you guys see here, your boy's tired as hell. Let's go another 10. You gotta rest up top for a second. Back to it. Last set, guys. Last set. Last set. Best set, baby. Last set. I'm gonna check the cameras and get back to doing what we do best. So, can you guys guess which one are we doing next? Front delts or side or rear delts? You let me know. So we failed. We only did it eight. So recharge and recollect. Wipe off the delts. And let's do two more. It's gonna happen, guys. You guys are gonna fail at some of these things. You're gonna take a little break and hop right back into it. One more for good luck. It's my rule. If I miss my rep count, I do one more. All right, let's check these cameras and let's move on to our last superset for the medial delts. Fantastic, guys, fantastic. I gotta remember that one of my cameras has a 30 minute record limit on it, so gotta make sure I can take that into account. Okay, let's do the last superset for our shoulders, our side delts. We're gonna start with the 20s. We're gonna be doing 20 reps up front. We're gonna start at the sides with the 10s, and we're gonna be doing 20 reps to the side. All right, let's do it. The difference between doing it up front and doing it at the side is at the side, we're gonna be trying to keep our elbows straight the whole time. At the front, there's gonna be a little bit of the curling of the elbows, all right? Let's get it. We're gonna be doing two sets back to back. So two sets back to back. And that's gonna be it, we're gonna move on to some Still, what are we moving on to next? Side, uh, front delts or rear delts? I'm mixing all my shoulders up. 
this super set again guys so what are we hitting fronts or or rears after this Woo. it is getting freaking hot in here holy crap I am currently on fire Alrighty, let's go guys. Come on, last side delt set. We're a little bit behind schedule, but it's all right. Let's go. Gotta catch up. We're really just trying to focus on getting reps here. You guys can do it, come on. Form doesn't really matter here. Just trying to pump as much blood in the side delts as possible. That's 10, let's get 10 more. I little hoopa, getting work. Hallelujah. Oh. That's it guys, that's it. You guys can do it, let's go. My feet are filthy. So I'm gonna actually go get another towel in here. In between them during my break. Come on guys, let's go, last 20. It's five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Woo! Oh man, guys, oh man. All right, so take a little bit, a one minute break. I'm gonna grab my towel inside. If I got a towel. I got a big towel. I'm gonna need this big towel. All right, I said a minute, it's been 30 seconds approximately. And if you guess rear delts, you guess wrong because we're doing fronts next. Can end with rear delts. All righty guys. So front delts, we're gonna start with three sets of what I like to call three at a time, or three of a kind front raises. We're gonna be doing 30 reps in total, really 10 reps, but you'll see what I mean. So grab your lightest pair of dumbbells, I'm gonna grab my tens, and let's do the three of a kind. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna start off first. Supinated grip, thumbs up, well, let's start over. Palms up, thumbs up, palms down. Palms up, thumbs up, Palms down, that's two. Thumbs up, palms up, thumbs up. Palms down, that's three. Ooh, 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 that's five. Ooh, ooh, that's six. That's seven. Palms up, thumbs up. Palms down, that's eight. Two more, guys, come on. Nine. Come on, guys, one more. And that's 10, baby. We got three more of those on the recipe for today. Let's take a 30 second break and get right back to it. Wait, I told you guys 35 minutes. Let's try to make it 35 minutes. I'm a man of my word, I'm a man of my word, guys. Whew. 
All right, let's see how, how bad I'm clipping this audio. Hopefully not too bad. Hey guys, let me quiet down a little bit so you guys don't get ear, ear raped. All right. Now, if you have a mirror, it's even better because you're gonna look like a jacked, muscular person. He, she, they, whatever you believe. All right, guys, we're about to hop back on the buffalo here. All right, guys, ready? Again, thumbs up, oh, palms up, thumbs up, palms down, that's one. Palms up, thumbs up, palms down, that's two. Palms up, thumbs up, palms down, that's three. Palms up, thumbs up, palms down, that's four. Palms up, thumbs up, palms down, that's five. Ah, uh, 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 that's six. Uh, 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 that's seven. Boom. Bam. Bang. That's eight. Two more. Ah, that's ten. Nine. And this is number ten, baby. One more set. You guys are killing it. I'm killing it. I'm proud of myself. You guys should be proud of yourselves, too. All right, we got 30 seconds on the clock. Like I said, we're a little behind, but it's all right. We're gonna make it through this one. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go, guys. Come on. Y'all got this, y'all got this, y'all got this. You guys are gonna love the last set. All right. Let's go. Last one of these guys. Remember? Palms up. I don't know why I'm starting with a thumbs up. Maybe because you thumbs up this video. That'd be great, guys. Remember, it doesn't matter really the order. What matters is you're hitting all three. And what did we just get to? We just got to number three. Four. And that's five. Oh man, my, my shoulders are on fire, guys. We got seven, eight, nine, and 10. Let's go, let's make sure we're getting this one done. Eight, nine, did I miss one, did I miss one? I don't know. Did I miss one, comment below. Okay guys, that is three sets for the front delts. Now we're gonna take a minute break in between and we are coming close to the end of this workout, guys. I'm proud of you. Are you proud of yourselves? Make sure you comment below and let me know what you think about this workout. Okay, so the next set, you guys are gonna love this thing. It is gonna be front raises with the plates and then we're gonna be doing front presses. We're gonna be doing 10 and 10. Now you might laugh at me because this weight is super light, but I promise you, y'all won't be laughing at me later, so let's go. I'm gonna bring the barbell over here. Remember, we're taking a little one minute break. Should have put clips on here. We don't use clips in this gym. We don't use clips in the water buffalo gym, guys. You already know. Okay, so let me, let me clear the, the saddle here. So we're gonna do this for front delts and we're gonna move right into rear delts after this, guys. We got 13 minutes left on the clock and we're gonna get it done. So I'm gonna do seated uh, presses for this one, but you guys can do either one. It's completely up to you. You guys choose what you guys want. All right. Now there's gonna be a little bit of a caveat to this, to this front raise with the plate. We're gonna be driving the car. Ready? We're gonna drive, we're gonna take a little swerve to the right and to the left, five right to right to the left. Ready, one. One. Two. Two. Three. Three. Four. Four. Five. Five. So the whole idea behind that is getting some rotation, internal and external rotation, just internal rotation, my bad, on the front raise there, and we're gonna be jumping into some presses here, guys. So like I said, I'm gonna sit down, and you're full and freely able to do whatever you like. It's a free country. So I'm gonna be doing them seated, and then probably throwing the bar towards you guys when I'm done. Let's get for 10. One, two, three, four, five, 
six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Take a 30 second break, guys. We're gonna do one more set of that, moving into rear delts, and then we got a spectacular finisher in the books. So it's always good to mix in some heavy weight with some light weight and getting some good contractions on the total exercises that we're doing. You wanna make sure you're getting a nice concentration of movement when you're doing things. So as you see that front press, I'm not going all the way up. Don't wanna involve the triceps too much. I'm trying to purely keep tension on that front delt. And I'm pressing through the front delt, almost like I'm doing front raises. Okay guys, you guys ready? Let's do one more set of this and let's move on to some rear delts and then we got an amazing finisher for you guys at the end. All right, let's go, ready? Let's drive the car, guys, drive the car. Let's go to work, go to work, let's go to work. Ready? Five on each side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Woo. Guys, 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 you don't understand how intense, how crazy my shoulders feel right now. I feel like I am a freaking beast. All right, and you should too. Go, 10 more, one. Come on, extra 10. Come on, guys. There you go, there you go, there you go, there you go. Added a little extra in there for the front delts, guys. And I hope you guys are enjoying this because I'm dying. If you're watching this and you're not working out, what are you doing? All right, guys. So we're taking another minute break in between. Now for the rear delts, we got nine minutes left. I'm gonna be hitting on the incline here, three sets of 20 reps with the light weight, and then we're gonna move into some bent over upright rows. So almost like a row. It sounds weird, right? Upright row bent over. Basically what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be having a slight arch in the back, and we're gonna be doing rear delts we're gonna be pulling almost like we're doing a row, but not really, because we're gonna keep in the shoulder, not in the back. Minimal trap extra engagement right here. So I'm gonna be doing, I'm gonna be doing a set on here, and then I'm gonna be doing a set on the dumbbells. That way you get a sense of uh, how you can do this exercise without a bench. You don't necessarily need a bench. So when I say doing it with the dumbbells, I mean doing it free. I'm gonna be hitting 20 reps here, 10 reps there, three sets. And then I got a, I got a special finisher for you guys. Let's get it. I just want to make sure you're getting a good squeeze on this one. Make sure you have good form. The reason why we're going light is because we want to make sure we're getting a nice contraction of the rear delts. Ah. Ah. 17, 18, 19. The burn, guys, is unreal, unreal. Got about eight more minutes left. Let's keep going, guys. Come on now. Killing it, killing it, killing it. Want to make sure you're getting a little bend in the back. Not all the way down, but not all the way up. Uh, 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 woo. 30 second break guys, 30 second break. Guys, the pump is unreal. The shoulders are on fire. Y'all don't even know. 
So what we want to do is essentially we want to make sure that we're getting a good squeeze, a nice contraction on the shoulders. And uh, I'm going to switch over to doing these bent over for those who are don't have the bench at home and, or at the gym and they want to do a, a freestanding. So our 30 seconds is almost up. Let's get right back into it, guys. We've got to beat this 35 minute mark. Hit that finisher, that finisher I've been talking about. I want to show you guys. Same here, not bent all the way over, kind of upright a little bit, and you want to make sure you're getting a good contraction on the rear delts. That's 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Oh man, these AirPods keep falling out. Wish you guys were here so I could hang out with you and listen to you guys talk. But uh, let's get right into it, guys. Just, like I said, so the beauty about this exercise is that you're actually hitting the entire shoulder. And as the lower you go, the more traps you get. The more you're pulling back, the more traps you get. So you can kind of mix your arms in there so you can switch some of the shoulder engagement. And, uh, you know, just try it for yourself. So you stand all the way up normally on upright row and you pull a row you're bent over. We're somewhere in the middle. And we're getting the light weight so we can get the nice squeeze. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Ooh. All right, guys, one more set, and then we got that finisher. Man, guys, I am feeling this burn, and I realize that this camera's a little tilted. Let's fix this. Hopefully, my music is on par. Let's switch this over to a little bit of Biggie. Oh, man. I am absolutely feeling it today, guys. with the 20s on this set guys go big or go home baby last couple minutes of the workout I'm gonna be going to 23. One, two, three, four, four, three, two, one. Ah, guys, guys, guys. Like I said, the pump is unreal. Guys, y'all gotta get in on this. Make sure you comment below if you like this workout so far. We got about three minutes left, three and a half minutes left. So we're gonna do our last set on rear delts and move right into the finisher, guys. Let's get it. Three. 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 Get that towel, guys, get that rest in, and let's move right into the finisher. So essentially what we're gonna be doing for this last exercise, guys, is we are gonna be doing a alphabet. Whoa, checking the cam here, guys, checking the cam here. So we're gonna start with that plate that we did the front raise with, the 45. Go alphabet, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Go back to the 25, Z to A, and then we're finito. Now, can y'all handle it? Can y'all handle it? Comment below. Are you enjoying this workout? Are you watching? You better not be watching. You better be doing with me. Let's go, guys. We got about two and a half minutes left. Let's make this 35 minute mark. Y'all ready to go along with me? Let's do it. Ready? A. B. C. D. E. F. G, H, I, J, K, L, M. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. I can do this. Let's go. Come on, guys. Come on. You can do this. Don't stop. If you're, if you're going, keep, don't stop. Don't be like me. Be better than me. 
go. N O P Q R Damn. Come on guys, push me through, push me through. What the hell kind of ass was that? T U W X Y Z Alright guys, the last set. Let's go. Back up to A. Let's see if I can do the drunk sobriety test, guys. Whew, I need some aminos right now. I need some B3. Alrighty guys. Z Y W X Y X no X V U T S Q No R So R and then Q Q R S N O P P O N M L K K Okay, what's the JK? JK J A B C D E F G H I J I Damn, this is harder to work out than the actual workout so H H I J K A B C D E F G H Ah G A B C D E F F G E D C B A Woo! Boom baby The workout is now complete a crazy finisher, a crazy workout, guys. I am sweating, I am dripping, I am pumped. I'm ready to do some cardio. Thank you guys for watching this video. Make sure to comment, like, subscribe. Check out all the other videos we got on our channel. We appreciate you guys' support. This is Old School Matt with Water Buffalo Training Method. Man, this workout has been crazy, guys. I appreciate y'all for watching. I'll catch you guys on the next video. Stay tuned for more workouts like this. Shoulder workout in under 35 minutes. Front side and rear. Let's get it. Stay buff. Let's go, Buff Squad. Hey guys, thank you guys for checking out this video. Make sure to go check out all of our other podcasts, Buffalo Barbecues, our Buffalo Workouts, and also a slew of other things, including challenges and whatnot. So make sure to check out all of these different things. Thank you guys for watching. I am Old School Matt here, and this is Water Buffalo TM. Peace.